All right, guys, we just came back from Trader Joe's, and I'm going to show you what we picked up. First is something new that I haven't had before. This is the sliced French brioche bread. It's buttery, moist, and perfectly French. So it looks like this. It looks delicious. The cashier said this makes great French toast. And I think it'll be a good grilled cheese sandwich as well with some tomatoes. So it's very soft and it smells really good. And then we got some chili onion crunch without the armpit smell this time. If you guys remember last time I bought this, it smelled like chili onion crunch in the aisle that I got this in. But this is really good. It's really good on potatoes. That's what we eat it on mainly. And then I've got two jars of pepper jelly because I really thought that I was going to be the only person to like this. But Sarah freaking loves this stuff too. So we got two jars this time. And then we've got some everyday seasoning. This is delicious. Quickly has become one of my favorite things ever. Along with the 21 seasoning salute. I love this stuff too. This one doesn't have salt. This one has salt. And we've got some fruit because we healthy around here. We've got some, what are these? Nectarines. Got two nectarines. We've got six plums because plums are delicious. And these are only 59 cents a piece at Trader Joe's. So get you some plums, sis. And then we've got avocados. These ones are rock solid because I actually got some avocados from Whole Foods yesterday. So... <laughs> And then mom bought a mango for mango salsa. And then I love these tomatoes. What are these? The San Marzano tomatoes. You know, Gordon Ramsay put me on to these. <laughs> but these are really good. I love these. And then we've got some red onion. <laughs> if you, I love Gordon Ramsay. I don't know why, but I freaking love Gordon Ramsay. And then I've got my favorite sparkling water, the Cranberry Clementine. I only got two because I also got some lime sparkling water from Whole Foods yesterday as well. Then we've got some cheese. Less cheese than usual. So this one's new to me. I've never had this one before. It's the Unexpected Cheddar Cheese. I honestly don't even remember what the description was that made me buy it, but uh, I'll see when I make something with it. It'll be unexpected. And then we've got mozzarella. Oh, it's pre-sliced. Nice. Mom made a, was it vegan? Oh, duh, why did I even ask that? I'm holding <laughs> cheese I'm talking about, was it vegan? Mom made a vegetarian lasagna and she made a meat lasagna for the rest of my family because but this was, <laughs> this was really good in the lasagna. And then we've got the Wisconsin Extra Sharp Cheddar. We always get that. And then Sarah made some super bomb mozzarella sticks. So we'll have to do a video of her making those. So we got some string cheese so she can make that again. And then we've got some broccoli slaw, which is cheaper than getting it at Whole Foods. So I can make egg rolls which i did get broccoli slaw from whole foods i won't use all the um all the egg roll wrapper so i went ahead and bought another bag so we can have egg rolls another time then we've got some arugula as always mom saw a recipe for seafood for a seafood pizza so we've got some dough for that we've got some gold potatoes gold potatoes and red potatoes and fingerling potatoes are the best potatoes. Gold are the best, like number one. Red potatoes are number two, fingerling potatoes are number three. Gold potatoes, chef's kiss. And then we've got the Kamado, I was about to call these potatoes, tomatoes. These are the best tomatoes of life. Can't wait to have these on that brioche bread with some cheese and make a nice little grilled cheese, little, little sandwich. And then Trader Joe's sells impossible plant-based meat now. I don't wanna call it meat because it's not meat, but a plant-based burger substitute. 
We've got some regular vine tomatoes. They have kimchi now. So I'm super excited about that. I love kimchi. But the only other place that ever had it was Fresh Market, which doesn't exist anymore here. So brought some kimchi. And then I've got some dark chocolate almonds. These have sea salt and turbinado sugar. I thought these looked tasty. So I got some of these for a little, little treat. And then I love these. Um, I didn't even know that they had like the huge one. I usually just buy the little 99 cent bags, but the dark chocolate peanut butter cups. I never really look at like the chocolate. Oh, thank you. I never really look at like the chocolate and stuff because I don't really eat sweets, but I thought these would be nice to have. I used to get the little, the three bars or the, uh, the small pack of the peanut butter cups at the register but you know i don't be touching stuff no more not just playing um but um i thought i would just try this out instead of continuing to buy those i know these are gonna last me like a long period of time we've got some wild rice which is delicioso and then you guys already know my mom bought like 47 boxes of the breakfast patties two she bought six six boxes and i'm pretty sure we still have some boxes in the freezer yeah we do and then oh she bought grits she made shrimp and grits one day i don't know if i vlogged that it was so good y'all then we've got some chia seeds organic sustainably grown okay trader joe's go off and then we have some frit Ooh, she <laughs> time de francais okay and then some umami seasoning and some smoked paprika. This is the best smoked paprika we've had for sure. And then I bought two bottles of wine this time. I just got two, I did good. This is a white wine and you guys know I read the notes and if the bottle, the packaging is nice, I'll buy it. If the packaging ain't hitting right, I'm not buying it. So this was like vibrant and cute or whatever in the notes seemed cool so i thought i'd try it out and then this look at this bottle i don't even remember what aisle this was on but i read the notes and it sounded delish and i was like this bottle is beautiful so i picked it up so then we've got you guys by this point should be familiar with kidra so i'm just gonna call it kidra i'm not gonna keep saying my aunt that sounds weird <laughs> so she brought these over um and these are really good so if you don't like sparkling water like no one in my house does um they were roasting me they were like oh this tastes way better than that stuff that you be buying <laughs> um so get some sparkling juice if you don't like sparkling water so this is the watermelon flavor and you bought strawberry didn't you mm -hmm. and then kedra bought strawberry to try so they were actually really good they also make pretty good alcoholic beverages as well. So then, is this the one? Yeah, this we'll is, try, yeah. okay. This is some Seco. This is grapefruit. We haven't had this one. Which ones have we had? Just this one? The raspberry and the peach. Ooh, strawberry, raspberry, and then we've had the peach one before. And they were, I like the peach one better than this one. I like grapefruit, so I think that'll probably be good too. And then she can keep it. This y'all already knows my mom's. This is Riesling. Oh, okay. And then this is a Merlot, a semi-sweet Merlot. This one's not too bad. If you don't like um, super sweet wine, but if you also don't like bitter wine, this is a good um, middle ground because I like bitter wine. And my mom used to like super sweet wine, but now she likes wines that are more in the middle. Yeah, semi-sweet. But sometimes they say semi-sweet and it will taste like freaking juice. So pff, this one actually does taste like a nice little semi-sweet wine. She really likes this one, so. And then we got the vodka. <laughs> this is actually lasts, really good oh, vodka. I keep it a long time. Yeah, it lasts a long time and it's actually really good and it's pretty affordable too so our 
favorite um well he doesn't work there anymore shout out to you david um I, he probably definitely doesn't watch youtube but <laughs> <laughs> he was our favorite okay we don't have favorites but he was awesome and he would always recommend like food and like he when it came to hot sauce and alcohol that was my guy so he recommended this particular one and it has not disappointed and that was like over a year ago and we still buy this one so check it out and then what is another reason you guys know if joseph hondra and bluefin you already know it's my mom's and then y'all know that tiktok is like what in the tarnation alabama this is a freaking plastic bottle at our trader joe's it's on the shelf when you like first walk in i was like whoa that's a huge bottle of sangria and it's only like six dollars and my mom and Keetra were like, ooh, sangria. I wonder if that tastes good. And picked it up and was like, oh, no, ma'am. Plastic. <laughs> Look how huge it is. And then margarita mix. And yes, in this house, we do make margaritas with vodka. I like tequila. But mom is not huge into tequila. I don't know. I like everything. This is our mini liquor store. Yeah, we don't go to the store often. You guys already know. This is only my fourth time leaving my house since March 13th. So, y'all, they have it outside today. But yeah, this is it for Trader Joe's. And then I got some other stuff that I'll show you guys. So, you guys, we also went to the Dollar Tree and hobby lobby you guys know how my mom is with the tablescapes the tablescapes are coming back so at hobby lobby we've got a tablecloth you guys know hobby lobby and michaels are always coming through with the deals so we hit the spring clearance section and it was like 75 percent off we've got these chargers i like these these are pretty cool and she's gonna use these little plates and there's gonna be a white plate underneath this plate's gonna be on top this tray that's going to be in the middle you see the look she's going for with the patterns and things i see it and then she bought these she y'all she loves led candles for like when candles. she likes real candles but i haven't made any so she likes to have candles like really at night time when she's watching movies and stuff and then this was like a dollar i think then she got some pumpkins and some pine cones for the tablescape if you can see see the vision for the tablescape what she's going for in here and then for my room, you guys know I love fall. I love winter. I'm going to be de doing some decorating videos again. It's going to be even better this year. So I bought this because I have like some flowers. And you just stick it into the flowers. And the fall stuff was 40% off. So I got this little pumpkin. And then I got this little arrangement. Because I have quite a few vases in my room. And I thought this was cool. And um, it goes with my room. This is pretty much the color scheme of my room all year round and then look at this little pumpkin they had a, heat, a bigger one but i didn't really want the big one so i got a little one to go with my other little pumpkins i also got this how cool is this this was 50 percent off so it ended up being like ten dollars which is awesome but i think i'm gonna use it for my jewelry because right now my jewelry is just like laid out. I think the stuff that I don't wear every day, I'll put in here. Uh, the handles match some other leather stuff that I have. And I have like this natural wood. It matches my room perfectly. If you watch my videos, you'll see my room in the background. It looks like this. We went to Books A Million and we got some books. Mm -hmm. So my mom got, is this a journal? Mm -hmm. So this is a journal. It says, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Look at me being a good Christian. Yes, I know Psalms 9, 4, wait, 91, 4. Yeah. This guy is dope. <laughs> uh -huh. Good price. And then she got Revisioning the Earth, a guide to opening the healing channels between mind and nature. This sounds interesting. I really might cheap. give that a read. And then she got journey to jesus oh okay that is cool that's cool just to get a little deeper yeah also you guys we're getting new floors 
Oh, okay, wait. Mom's super excited. So I got. <laughs> I'm not saying guys, nothing to do with Jesus. <laughs> I bought a book about the apocalypse, short stories <laughs> about endless apocalypse. So they have like this whole section of like these kinds of short stories. So I got um, this one, which if you couldn't tell, it's short stories about different ways about an apocalypse happening. And then the other one that I got, I got this one. This one's gothic. The other one was thrilling. It takes place in like medieval eras. So you got knights and dragons, I think. Is this the one with the knights and dragons? Yeah, dragons, knights, monsters, and magic. I like stuff like that. They had a bunch of these different versions. So if I like it, I'll get some more. And they were only 10 bucks. Actually, mine were cheaper because you know teach. She's a member in this house. We love a discount. Guys, ew, my foot, you can see my foot. <laughs> so my mom also got this at Books A Million and it comes with like a little chalk marker pen. Oh, it was only $13. It just has the days of the week. You can put the month up here and the date. So this is cool. So then we went to the Dollar Tree too and my mom got these shelves. They're like flowing shelves and they're only a dollar. So that's really cool. She yeah, she literally bought eight of these for the office and oh, Sarah and Andrea. Yeah. Sarah and Andrea, um, they're redoing their room. She got some fall decor. And then she got these oh, little pumpkin thing. Actually, that's probably where this stuff will end up being because Sarah's like me now. She likes to decorate for all the holidays. So she got two packs of, oh no, they're different sizes. So she got the big ones and the small ones. And then we got a spatula. Because <laughs> there's a reason. Yeah, mom. Meal prep for your aunt. Yeah, mom has become Kedra's personal chef. And Kedra eats meat, so she bought her her own meat spatula part-time vegan <laughs> yeah she's still part-time vegan my mom bought craft sticks I can't remember why, but I will and highlighters and this is for their organization for jewelry i think that's everything that's everything